Hey guys, it's Kristen with another chance resale. Don't fast forward through this intro. I have very important announcements to make before we get into the purse sale. So um, there will be no holds. Uh, if you want to purchase something, be ready to purchase immediately upon emailing me and me getting back to you that it, it is available or not. Also, please look in the comment section below. I will be posting a comment that will be pinned to the top of the list of sold purses as they're selling. Um, if you have not bought from me before, please make sure you include your mailing address and PayPal email in the email that you're sending me so I can send you the invoice immediately. This is very important because the purse sales that I do um, they get a lot of attention and I get a lot of emails, so I want to try to make this as easy as possible for me and you guys. So um, I do answer every email and I answer them in the order that they come in. So like I start from the bottom and work my way up. Um, so I would prefer if you send one general email of what you're interested in instead of as you're watching sending me an email because I don't know that you're sending me like four emails. So I respond, yes, this is available, I'll invoice you, and then I invoice you, and then I see you know, four people up that you emailed again. I, I get very confused. So if it is possible, please email all in one email. Um, you know, if, if you wanna send multiples, I can't tell you not to, I just, can ask if you can put them all in one. Um, I have a lot of purses. We have 45 to go through. <laughs> so I want to um, get out, get a piece of paper, get a pen, get something to write down the timestamps because I want you guys on the bottom of the screen, you'll, there'll be a timestamp of the item, you know, when it's playing, what the timestamp is, I need that. Um, or the screenshot of the item or just a very good description because there are multiples from the same designer like there's a bunch of coach purses um, so as descriptive as you can let's make this easy for everybody and um, my email is another chance resale one at gmail.com all my information will be in the description box below um, payment is required immediately if things like if it drags into the next day or whatever i have to move on to the next person just try to be fair everyone needs to be fair to each other and everyone needs to have respect for each other okay so don't take offense to that i just have to lay down some rules and um so everyone can be fair and we can all get we can all get our purses okay so all these prices are not including shipping so once you email me that you are interested in a purse I take you know your location from my location and figure out the shipping on my pirate ship I use pirate ship to do all my shipping okay so enough of that um, 45 purses I have them all listed here um, we're gonna go over some that didn't sell from previous um, previous videos and then we also have two thread up name brand handbag rescue boxes to go through so that's another 10 purses so that's 55 65 purses we have in this video so this is the mother load the the main event of my purse videos and here it is for you so um, I have purses all around me uh, here on the floor here over there so I will be pausing the video you guys won't notice the pause um, just so I can reach everything so let's start by a few of the purses that haven't actually this is my um, wrap bracelet from touchstone crystal by Swarovski so if you're interested we have a sale on all of our wrap bracelets this month you can also use them to wrap around your bun they also fit around your head as a really pretty headband um, or as a necklace so make sure you check those out I will leave them in a uh, link in the description box they come in like 20 or 30 different colors it's really cool so with that being said let's go to the first purse that needs to find a home and it is this gorgeous Rebecca Minkoff that I can't believe hasn't sold it clips here it has the pocket there um, this has been loved. There is some wear here. 
it has the chain with the studded um, shoulder. Here's the back, here's the bottom. The inside has been well loved. There's no stains, but there's a little fading. Do you see that color fade? But other than that, it's good. And we have the slip pocket there with the Rebecca Minkoff. And as you guys know, if I carry over items from previous videos that did not sell, the price goes lower. So this one is now down to $23. So $23, Rebecca Minkoff, super cute, brown, uh, like beige leather. Okay, now I have to figure out where I'm gonna put the ones that I finished talking about. <laughs> okay, so next one is the Fossil Wristlet. So this is Fossil, it is a like coated canvas. There's the Fossil, it's a little wristlet or you can put it in your purse to help organize yourself. And this one is now, uh, this one is 10 still, I can't go any lower than that, $10. Based on what I pay for it, that's how I figure out what I can give it to you guys for. Okay, next is another Fossil. And it is this um, crossbody, beautiful brown pebbled leather. There are the corners, the back. I thought that was a pocket. Um, zipper pocket there. It has the leather on one side and the fabric on the other side. The opening, and you have it's a little it's a little dirty. The, those two are just little marks, but other than that. There's nothing else in there. There's the slip pocket and the zipper pocket. Okay, and the tag is right here. There we go, and this one has dropped to $24. This one's really cute. If I didn't already have a crossbody purse that I spent $50 on, I'd be keeping this. <laughs> okay, next is a coach. And this one, I believe I had some interest in in the last video, but nobody ever got back to me. I was reaching out. I was asking, you know, people if they wanted it or not. I never heard back. So, I, you know, I don't know what happened. So if you were one of those people and you do want this, you can email me because this slipped through the cracks of a few different people. And this is a black leather. Um small handles but it can still fit over your shoulder and it has the purple uh, like lavender interior so it is a, there is a little bit of a mark on the creed but other than that the rest of it is pretty good so like i said i don't know what happened with the people that were interested in this but that's what happens and you know i would rather you guys just say i'm not interested than to just disappear on me so this one is 30. $30. Very cute. Classic little purse. Okay, next we have the Tignanello. This one did not sell from the last um, video. This is a super cool leather patchwork with the two pockets here. Leather bottom. I did condition like 99% of these. Um, with the Dr. Martin Wonder Balsam. I will also link that in the description. It is excellent for leather products. There's the Tegnanello and clean inside. I do have the window open, so if you hear stuff, it's outside. <laughs> like the bird, if you hear that bird in the background. Um, so this one is $26. Very cute. I do not have, what is there supposed to be? No, there's no um, shoulder. No shoulder strap on this one, just this strap. So that one is 26. So now we have another fossil. We have this super cute brown woven purse. Great for the spring and summer. Great beachy vibes with the woven and the leather. Very nice, excellent condition zipper closure and then you have the slip pockets there zipper there there's your little fossil creed super cute and this one is down to 23 
Um, coach, another coach. Where is this one? Coach, oh, here we go. This one is another black coach. This is more of like a little hobo style, little floppy purse. It is in excellent condition. And the inside is blue. It is a little dirty down there, but it's really nothing crazy. And this one we have down to 25. That's another classic. Um, okay, now we have this one. I'm starting to feel a little fuzzies flying around. So some of these were from my uh, Coach um, Thread Up Rescue Box. So this one was one of them. It is a super large tote, beautiful blue. It is in good condition. However, the um, edge coating is starting to come off on the handles, see that? But if you don't mind that, like I, I personally wouldn't care because this is a really great bag. Um, I mean, it's awesome. You have the two, look at that cool tag, hang tags, and we got this one down to $25. $25, guys. I mean, who cares about the little bit of edge coating? See, like, just peel that off. Who cares? <laughs> so $25 on that one. Um, all right, then we got another coach. This one I got in the rescue box also. There's really nothing wrong here. It's a beautiful, like, metallic gray silver. Um, yes, it's a little wrinkled, but once you have all your stuff in it, you'll be fine. The problem with this one is the handles are cracked. But other than that, we are good to go. It is a zipper closure. And then there's just a pen mark down at the bottom there. But there's nothing on the inside. There's no... Um, pockets or anything so it's just open and this one I'm bringing down to ten dollars ten dollars for this guys even if even if you use it for the gym or for um, you know traveling or the beach or something good carry-on bag ten dollars okay next we're gonna go into some some purses I found at an estate sale this past weekend and we have this one, which is Vera Bradley. Now you guys know I don't normally pick up Vera Bradley because I feel like there's so many different patterns and the market is saturated with them. I do know people still buy them and wear them, which is fine, but I only pick them up if they were new with tag. So this one is new with tag and it is the Mediterranean White and it is $56 retail. It is white and it does not have any stains that I found. And it has the back pocket and also this front zipper with your slip pockets on the side there. Really cool. Great for the summer. This could be a crossbody or a shoulder purse. And this one we're doing 25. So that's like half off, more than half off price tag pretty cool makes a great gift all right um, Mother's Day is coming remember and also let me reiterate if you're interested in anything please email me at another chance resale one at gmail.com please give as much information as you can to help the process go smoothly um, email uh, PayPal email mailing address if you haven't shopped with me before and um, timestamp screenshot description of the item and payment is required immediately, no holds. Um, there's a lot of people that email me about these items, so we wanna be fair to everybody. Make sure you check the comment section where there's a pinned comment of the sold purses. I will update that as they are selling. Okay, let's move on. <laughs> um, let's do, okay, so we have this Estee Lauder. I loved the print on this, so that's why I got it. It is just a little makeup bag with the patent leather. Oh, there's something in it. <laughs> I didn't even open it. So it's just the card 
that it came with and somebody's somebody's grocery list eyeshadow tea biscuits I don't know what that says mag something <laughs> so um, it is plain on the inside it doesn't even look like it's been used maybe I don't know since there was this list in it so this one we're going to do $8 and it has the little hang tag with the Estee Lauder. Love that print. Um, okay, this one, this one, I when I saw this at the estate sale, I snatched it up so fast, I thought it was the coolest thing. So I looked up the brand, and it is Nima, which the hang tag is right here. And it actually, this bag is from the 80s. So as you can see, it has the chain and faux leather handle and look at this look at that isn't he cool it is a silver tone cheetah and you open it like this and there's your inside little compartments so stinking cool oh my gosh I love this one if I went out a lot, I would totally be keeping this. Um, this is $20. Super unique from the 80s, love it. Okay, now we have some um, like Asian purses. They're, they were handmade, this is what I was told by the estate sale lady, that these were handmade when the woman that you know lived in the house, when she went to China. I don't know if that is the truth. I know when I buy stuff on online auctions, sometimes they tend to fib a little bit just to get people to buy the items. Well, they were they were a good price, so I decided to get them just to have like something a little different because you know I like to show you guys different items, unique items. Um, these are definitely super vintage and very um, like classy. It's I don't know if this is silk, but it sure does feel like it. I mean, look at that inside. And it even comes with a mirror that is attached in the little pocket on the side here. I mean, how cute is this? It has the little snap adorable little clutch and it will fit it will fit the phone I have an 11 Pro Max so that's a big one and it will fit so um, this one is ten dollars the, they're both ten dollars this one too so this one this one I think is cooler so this one is all embroidered look at that all that embroidery. This is real jade. I did test it on my gem tester. Um, there is some missing right there, but look at that design. Oh my gosh, how awesome is that? Then you've got like the butterfly over here and oh my gosh, okay. So um, this one we open here. Look at that interior. The two pockets, and then we even have this zipper pocket here. So cool. What does that say? It's patent, patent pending with a number. And you can probably hold it like this. Just be careful. So pretty. So $10 each, this has the jade, but it also is missing some embroidery. Even right here, it's missing like some threads for the um, antenna, antennae. <laughs> okay, so $10 each on those. Now that's one stack done. That's one page done. So let's go on to the next page and we are going to talk about this Fendi purse. 
Okay, so um, I own a Fendi purse. It is black and it has like the F's, but it's, um, you know, like black on black. So you can only really see it when it's like in the sun, you know? Um, and I compared it. Okay, so here's the thing. I could not find a serial number on this. Usually the serial number is in the interior pocket. I looked everywhere. I had my husband look everywhere. We tried looking up similar ones online. Um, we do, I do not believe that this is authentic. So I cannot sell it as authentic. However, it is a very good dupe. Um, we have the Fendi there. It's just you can kind of feel in the fabric that it's not really, you know, the greatest. It is very nice. Like, look at the inside. Hold on. Like, it even has the Fendi print right there. And usually, sometimes there'll be a serial number, like, going down like that, too. And there's that. But usually it's in, like my serial number is in the inside of the pocket and it's printed this way. So I did not find that on this one. So I am not comfortable selling this as authentic. Um, if it is, then you know, you win. And there's a little, it did come with a tag, but to me this doesn't, I'm not an expert, but I, I just, I don't feel that this is real, but it is very nice nonetheless. Um, the numbers on here are real numbers. Like we typed it in, the scan doesn't work. Like we tried to scan it on eBay, it doesn't work. Um, but the numbers are real, but they bring up a different purse. So we think that it was just copied. Um, anyway, with that being said, it is still very cute little um you know evening bag and we're gonna do 25 on it okay still very cute i mean from a distance it's gonna look real you're everyone's gonna think that it's real it's just it doesn't have a serial number so i can't sell it as real 25. okay next i gotta dig these out of the way okay next we have some vintage that's going to be um, kind of infiltrating in with the other purses. And this is the first one, and we, it's a beautiful gold tone beaded purse. Very cute. Very vintage. Check out that inside. No name, but it does feel like quality. And this one is going to be 18. And you know, wedding season's coming. If anyone's going to a wedding, I am next month. You know, keep an eye, you know, keep keep a um keep your eye out for some wedding purses. Okay, that's that one. We have these two, which are the same but different colorways beautiful beaded oh my gosh so beautiful excellent condition this one does come with the handle you can wear it on your shoulder the tag what does the tag say Jerome's made in Hong Kong so this is definitely an 80s purse Here's the other one. Here is the chain. And these are going to be $18 each. So just make sure if you are interested in these, you say which one you want, like describe the colors, okay? Yellow, blue, green, I guess. <laughs> okay. Next, we're going to do some Michael Kors. Michael, Michael, Michael Kors. We have this beaut, 
It is red pebbled leather. Beautiful condition. Love that hang tag. Love the red and gold. Great straps. The inside still has the Michael Kors paper, slip pockets, Michael Kors on that side, the slip pocket and um, zipper pocket, original Michael Kors paper. And this one we are doing 35. Beautiful. Piling up the purses over here. Okay, next is this Dooney and Burke. We do have more Michael Kors, don't worry. <laughs> um, this is Dooney and Burke. It is white and it has the crossbody strap. Here is the back. It's got a little teeny bit of wear along the bottom. And um, here's the front pocket. We have the main compartment up here. This is definitely an older one, but a goody one. Look at that cute interior. You can tell it's vintage by the size of the phone, the phone slip. We don't have phones that small anymore. So this one we are doing 30 on. Excellent for this time of the year. Uh, next we have, okay. So this one's pretty cool. This is Coach. And this is this cute little, like, put your phone in it and attach it to your hip. Where's my phone? There's my phone. Attach it to your hip or your purse or something. Uh, if you're hiking, if you're walking, if you're, you know, whatever. I think this is super cute. Awesome, or you can even use it for your wallet and stuff for easy access, maybe if you're traveling or something. There you go, and this one is 18. Very cool. Um, all right, this next one is super awesome. Designer, MZ Wallace. It is the micro crossbody. Okay, so there's the crossbody strap. It is quilted patent leather. It has this cute little handle if you wanna use the handle. It is in excellent condition. These are going for over $100 on eBay right now. The inside has the MZ Wallace and the credit card slots. Here's your phone slips right in awesome little crossbody for just running out for doing yard sales estate sailing you put your wallet in there maybe throw a couple bucks in here it is perfect uh, like i said these are ranging used anywhere from 100 to 250 used on ebay i almost said amazon you um listed right now on ebay this one i'm bringing to you guys for 80 dollars. this is the coolest thing I've ever seen. Super cute, super easy, awesome. 80 bucks. Okay, next we have a vintage, really cute brown suede with the leather handles. And we open it like, <laughs> like that. Flap comes up and it kind of expands. There's the pocket right there. Very nice condition. Awesome. No name, no maker. And this one is 24. Very classy and sophisticated. So next we're gonna do, where is this? Okay, so next we have a unmarked little hard clutch. This is black studded, as you can see, with the gold tone. And the inside, you open it like so. This is a great wedding guest purse as well. 
There is a little pocket right here. I don't know if it's coming through on the screen all that well. And it does have the chain. And I believe my phone does fit in here as well. Let's double check. Yes, it does. Yes, indeedy. So that is perfect. Oh, I just dropped my list. And this one is 19. Very cool. All right, I'm starting to run out of room. We'll finish these few and then I'm gonna move these ones and move other ones in. <laughs> so next we have another vintage and this little cutie is beaded. Excellent for this time of year. With the kiss lock top, little pocket there. This one, my phone does not fit into. So you have to, if you want your phone in there, it's gonna be, have to be smaller than the 11. So here is the handle. I really don't see any damage to it. It looks very nice and very well made. So we are doing 14 on this one. All right, next we have this little cutie. It is a silver metallic and it's got a like little nut or something <laughs> on the top there. It's all blinged out. This is by um, Morris Moskowitz and it's got a really nice interior with the um, name there and a the little slip pocket there. Um, it is smaller, it will not fit my phone either but it is in excellent condition. And this one is 15. Awesome, 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 awesome. Okay, next we have a Rebecca Minkoff. And here she is. That's just a little little doo-doo but that'll be that'll come off i did not condition this one because i thought it looked nice but i probably should have it's got these black studs down the front here is the strap it's a hefty strap and this is the back with the rebecca mink off down there this is really cool i don't really like like floppy purses like this unless I keep this I like a very structured purse but this and then you open that up you have this pocket and then you have the main pocket this one is so nice I mean it's it's the raw leather so it's got the suede on the inside there's no lining or pockets it's very cool I love it this one we're doing 45 okay Next we have, this one is actually my favorite out of all of them, believe it or not. When you see the rest, I mean, I don't know. You guys kind of get my style. I like the studs. I like, you know, I like nice, I like pretty things, but like with a spin on it, like an edginess. So this one definitely fits the bill. This one is by Botkier. You guys can correct me, B-O-T-K-I-E-R, Botkier. I probably mispronounced it, but it's like a, um, it's, I think it's black, but it almost comes off as like a green. Either way, I think it's awesome. And it's got the gold tone. And this is, a, it reminds me of Rebecca Minkoff with all these tassels. So you got the, the pocket there on the back, you've got the pocket I oh, know the front is in a pocket just the back but these are pockets and then you have the inside there's the inside with the label and there's the slip pocket this one's very cool I love it I love the studs I love the gold tone contrast I love the tassels I love the color, so this one we're doing 30. Very cool. 
Okay, so that was all the purses that I have on the side here. So let me pause you guys and I'll be back with more. Okay, we're back. And I have more purses for you guys. And the first one is Vince Camuto. This beautiful blue um, tote bag. We have the Vince Camuto tag. We also have it on the front here. Well, actually, I think this is the front. And then we have this little piece. Now, it does come with the dust bag. And the main compartment is zippered, like so. And then this compartment up front, you just open this and there's the smaller front pocket. This is also, I mean, all these are in excellent condition. Um, it does, it's a little bent from being in the box, but just keep it on a chair with your stuff in it and it will definitely fix itself. I mean, this is beautiful. This one's 40. So pretty. Okay, next one. Okay, you guys are gonna love this one. So, two words. That's all I'm giving you guys for this purse. Hope you guys all get it. Flava Flav! <laughs> Look at how cool this is. So it's pat <laughs> black patent leather. I fixed the, the I um, changed the battery, so now it's really working and it's got some studs and rhinestones along the top. Pocket on the back, excellent condition. The brand is called Far9. So there it is, as I hit myself in the face. There's the main, and this is how you get to the clock. Just unzip it. This is so cool, even if you wanna use it for a Halloween costume, I think it is very unique. And we're gonna do 20 bucks on this one. <laughs> Hopefully you guys know who Flava Flav is. Okay, if not, Google him, and then you'll leave a comment and let me know if that's not Flava Flav or not. <laughs> All right, so next we're gonna go, we're gonna go to Italy, and we're gonna bring back this purse. Now, there is a shoulder strap that comes with this. I'm. It's coming, I, we're getting it. <laughs> um, it. I didn't have it, well, when I got the purses, I didn't have it, so it is being mailed to me. And it is genuine leather, green, with these awesome metal handles. And I stuffed the inside. But it is black on the inside, and it has a middle compartment there, and the zipper there. Oh, and we do have slip pockets on that side. Not that you can really see, but they're there. So it will have a shoulder strap. So whoever wants this, um, I will mail it when I get the shoulder strap so we can do it all together. And this one is 30. And it does say right here, made in Italy. It's just genuine leather. Okay, uh, next on the list is this super cool DKNY black leather with the chain handles. You can either have them doubled like this and be a little shorter or you can pull it all and to the front and have a longer strap. excellent condition so you get into this one by folding up here pulling that out and there you go um, there is no there's no pockets or anything in this one it's just a completely open there we go and this one is 23 <clears throat> next we have okay so this is another designer that is super like the prices on ebay are through the roof 
So it is, I'll probably mess up this one too. Daniela Lehavy, Lehavy. But there's her name there. And this is a fanny pack, or what the kids today now call them, belt bags. So this is a belt bag, and I think it is so cool. You just wear it like so, or you wear it on the side. <laughs> Or guys actually wear them now and they wear them like this. <laughs> so this one is a silver metallic leather. Um, you can just feel like the quality on this. It has the back pocket. It has two front pockets. The leather pulls. There's the brand super de duper nice i mean this is just awesome and again the comps on these bags run from you know 60 50 60 dollars all the way up to like 300 so it was really hard for me to price this so i'm doing 65 dollars it is in like impeccable condition the little buckle and you can adjust it so pretty that's actually another favorite of mine um, okay next we're doing this one which is new with tag so let's it is a beautiful very large patent leather dark gray purse and it is by Soha it's a hobo it had a $90, $90 price tag on it. And it's got all the rivets and studs and chain and everything. And then you, it has the chain handle with the reinforced top here. And then you open it, it's all snaps. And look at that big interior. It's very hard for me to show this one. But here's a slip pocket right there pockets and there's a zipper one down there cool interior very very large <laughs> and this one we're doing 40 um, okay next is another new with tag and it is this one patent leather black Sonia Roberts Right, that's what it says, yeah. Uh, chain handle, silver toggle. Still has all the paper still in it. Zipper pocket. Slip pockets. You can remove the chain if you want it to just be a clutch. This one is 25. So this one, I actually might use for the wedding next month. If nobody buys it, of course. There's a little boo-boo right there, but it is a really pretty hard case purse. This is like a, um, I don't know what this is. It could be leather, maybe faux, not really sure. But it has the gold chain handle and you pop it open and it's all open on the inside. Super cute. This one is $20. All right, next we have another Michael Kors. White, here's the handle. Did you guys hear that? That was my crazy neighbor downstairs laughing. Oh Lord, that was loud. Anyway, um, they also have, it also comes with th these handles back it up a little bit it is small excellent condition there's your MK and then the inside still has the MK paper there's the slip pockets and whatnot there you go excellent 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 condition we're doing 35 on this one 
All right. So next we have Fry. So this is a beautiful black leather. Um, I forget what they call these saddle bags, I think. And it is beautiful um, strap. We have the pocket on the back. It is very structured, just how I like it. And you open up the top and here's the inside. There's your fry. And there's nothing on the other side. So you just have that little pocket. Excellent, beautiful. <clears throat> this one we're gonna do 60. Super pretty, there's your fry on the front. Um, okay, that is it for this round of purses. So let me switch these out and get the next pile in and I'll be right back. Okay, let's keep on going. So remember, email me at anotherchanceresale1 at gmail.com if you're interested in anything. Please check the comment section for the pinned comment I will put of the sold um, purses so you know what is selling before you email me. And make sure if you haven't bought from me before, you send me an email with the description, timestamp, screenshot of the item, your PayPal email, and mailing address so I can figure out shipping and send you an invoice. No holds, payment is due upon receipt of the invoice. Bet you you're sick of hearing me say that. <laughs> okay, so, but people fast forward through the video and I always get comments asking exactly what I just told you, so I don't know. Anyway, so we're going to continue, and we are on this one. The This is Victoria Leather, which means butter. So look at this buttery red purse. It is super de-duper soft. We have this beautiful handle, long strap. Here is the Victoria little logo. Beam. And it is awesome. It opens the top here. There's Victoria. And it has uh, the zipper and the two compartments here. Three, actually. And here's the tag. <laughs> oh my god. It smells great. This is an amazing purse. It is in ex excellent condition. And we're doing 30 on this one. So, so beautiful. Love it. Okay, next we're doing la, 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 Nordstrom. So we have this beautiful croc leather embossed structured purse. It comes with two handles. You either have your short one, you have your short one here, or your long one here. I think I saw just a little bit of wear right there but otherwise excellent condition it does have the front and, and back pockets on the outside and the inside i bet you guys think there's stuffing in here right there's not <laughs> that's how structured this is so excellent tons of pockets that says nordstrom Super cute, excellent, classy, beautiful. This one is $30. Next we have this one. This is Foley and Corina. It is also buttery, smooth, awesome leather. It's this beautiful chestnut brown. It has the outside pocket here that you can expand. Let me zip that back up with all these tassels. It has the short straps with the um, gold tone here, but it, and it does have, it's just, it's got a little bit of thread issues and a little bit of edge coat right there problem, but it's really nothing serious. And it does come with the long shoulder strap and there's the name on that. And then the inside, has the label all over it like Marc Jacobs does. Slip pockets there. And there, zipper pocket. Very nice, if you like buttery leather, this is for you. 
two types of handles. So beautiful. And this is ba -ba -ba, $30 as well. <laughs> okay, so we're on to the last page. <laughs> so next we have, oops, dropped my list. Next we have a really, really unique made in Mexico purse. This is so Patricia Nash vibes. It is beautiful embossed leather with the rose. There is a pocket here and a pocket in the front. Very structured, excellent condition. We have two little pockets on the top there and then you have three compartments here with the zipper in the center. So stinking cool. And you even have a little tassel on the edge. Do, 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 do. <laughs> on the end. I said edge and end at the same time. Ed, edge. So this is 25. And next we're going to do this honker. Cole Han. It is very big. And it is a dark brown. Beautiful leather. There's Cole Han. There's the back, back, that's probably the front, with the two zippers. They are real, they are functional. And it has the strap, very excellent condition, magnet closure, one big pocket with your, all these pockets, look at all those pockets. And then the big slip on that side. Awesome purse. This is so cool. This one is 45. All right, next we have Coach. So we have Coach and it comes in the Coach um, dust bag. And look at this beaut. It is white pebbled leather, leather. <laughs> back pocket. There's your tag, bottom, um, awesome handles, silver tone, hardware, open it up, and it has all the original coach packaging, red interior with the slip pockets. There's your Creed with the um, zipper pocket. Beautiful. Very soft and smooth. This one we're doing 48. All right, next we have another coach and she also comes in a dust bag. I do not believe this is coach dust bag though. Oh wait, no, I'm looking at the wrong one. This one is the coach and it is the coach dust bag. <laughs> and this one is silver, metallic, leather. There's your coach hang tags. Excellent, beautiful handle, everything's excellent. Zipper, this one is stuffed as well. It has a light blue lining. There's your Creed. There's your uh, slip pockets. And the interior is excellent. Beautiful. And it comes with the dust bag, like I said. And this one is 45. Okay. Last... Last purse, and then we're gonna go into the thread up unboxings. So this one, is, it does come with the um, dust bag. This is, this is vintage Furla. I do believe it is vintage. Um, there is the Furla right there. It is leather, it is white, it is small and dainty. It is in very, it's in, it's in good, great condition. It's. It's in the middle because there are a little bit of marks like right there, right there. And then the back has 
this boo-boo, but it's the back, you know, no one's gonna see it. So then what you do is you open up here and you have a zipper and there's your furla with all the logo, the logo everywhere. Furla made in Italy and then the back it says genuine leather. So this I do believe is genuine, authentic. It even says furla on the um, little button right there. And these, these are on eBay all over the price spectrum from $50 to $300, depending on the size. So I'm doing $85 on this one. Very, very cool. Okay, so that wraps up my portion of the purses. Now we're gonna jump into the thread up section <laughs> of the video, and we're gonna go through two name brand handbag rescue boxes. So I'll be right back. <laughs> okay, I'm back. So I also want to um, tell you guys that with all these purses, I did get um, jewelry, shoes, and a little bit of clothing um, and some accessories like belts and stuff. So I'll be doing another video, I don't know when, going over all the shoes that will be for sale. Um, there's shoes such as Kate Spade, Tory Burch, Van Alley, um, Talbots. There's a couple of designers I've never heard of that I, when I looked them up on eBay, they are selling for $150. So keep an eye out for that video. Make sure you're subscribed. Make sure you click the bell at the bottom of the screen so you can be notified when these videos come out because those are going to be coming. Um, they're going to be pretty exciting. Like I love shoes. These are really cool. Um, okay, so let's just get into it. So here are the two name brand handbag boxes right here from Thread Up. They both, okay, so the first one we're gonna open is from Sh Shawnee, Swanee, I always do that. Swanee, Georgia. And the other one is from Mechanicsburg, Pennsylvania. So let's see what we got. <laughs> Such a dork, right? Okay. Remember, email me at anotherchanceresale1 at gmail.com if you're interested in anything. Check that pinned comment down below for what's sold. These thread up boxes are $100 and they are found under the rescue section of ThreadUp's website. I always get a comment about this that no one can get them. They're always unavailable. Yes, that is very true. I check the website so many times a day, it's actually pretty embarrassing and I really don't catch many of the releases at all. So you really have to refresh that screen like probably 500 times a day just to catch it because once they do release, they sell out so quickly. So these two I got on uh, two different weeks. So let me see, let me show you. This one I got on March 31st. So when I open up the other one, we'll let you know when I got that one. All right, we're using. Here's the first one, beautiful summer color. This is Kate Spade. It is a, it's like a seafoam green. It's, I think it's coming up more blue on the camera, but it's a little bit green. So right off the bat, I'm seeing this huge scratch. Is that scratch or doo-doo? I think it might be a scratch. There's a little boo-boo right there. But this is, oh. I mean, it's the bottom, who cares? There's the handle, the handles are good. It comes with the crossbody or shoulder strap. That's good. And the inside's good. There's the inside. Let's see, does it zipper? Yep. All right, so we just got a boo-boo on the front. Look, it's really not that noticeable. It's a super cute size and color for the spring, and we're gonna do $30 on it. How about that? How about that? And we always get the infamous Michael Kors as well with the Kate Spade. 
And here is, this one's actually really nice. This one feels like butter. It's the beautiful like chestnut brown. Here's your Michael Kors. The bottom's got some wear, but it's the bottom, who cares? There's a little, little mark right there. It's, this was definitely well loved. Um, the handles are fine, but they're just like really, like, like the oils of someone's hands really like, you know, matted these down, I guess you would say, but they're not ripped or anything. And the inside is pretty nice. There's just a couple of pen spots on the bottom, but I mean, this is awesome. This is a really nice bag. Oh, wait, actually, I do see something wrong with the handles. The edge coating is completely gone. But I mean, it's, it's not ripped, but you see where it was right here? It's not ripped or anything, so someone just really loved the heck out of this. And that's awesome. I like to see stuff like that. So well, let's do 30 on this one. It's still in very excellent condition. And it's very heavy. My, I can't carry Michael Kors bags because they're so heavy. Um, you would think I was like 75 years old. But, but um, I don't like a heavy handbag. But this one's nice. What did I say? 30? 30 dollars. All right. Ooh, what are you? You're pretty. I knew it. Rebecca Minkoff. I always get Rebecca Minkoff too, but this one's cool. I never got one like this. This is a really cool blue, like distressed leather. I knew it was, I kind of had a feeling it was Rebecca Minkoff because of the, the shape of these. It's like the crossbody I showed earlier. So let's look at the handles. We're good on the, it matches my shirt. <laughs> it's good on the handles. This is more of a blue though. It has a, this one's really nice. It has the shoulder strap. Here's the back, here's the front, pocket. It even comes with a little card. There's a paper clip in there. <laughs> I wonder if ThreadUp finds stuff, like what, what do they find in purses? Probably all kinds of stuff. There's your Rebecca. It's decent, it's good. Um, the inside, you know, you can tell it's been used, but it's not stained or dirty or anything. So um, I'm gonna condition this probably because it looks a little dry and we're gonna do 40 on this one. Okay, $40. All right. I don't like when they give wallets because it's not a handbag. This is a name brand handbag. Handbag, not name brand wallet. But, okay, that's fine, because it's Dooney and Burke, it's really nice, it's not like the little coach coin purse that I got in the last one. Um, it still has the tag, this scared me, it's a check. It's just like showing you that you can put your checks there. Specimen, nice. Um, there's the tag, it has $158 retail value. It's not bad, it's it's in good shape. There's a little bit of, um, there's a mark there and there's a mark down here. That just might be dirty, so I will try to clean that. But otherwise, this is nice. So let's do 20 bucks on this. Last but not least is another Dooney. I feel like I get the same brands all the time. This one is ginormo. Okay, hold on. Ugh. You can't even see it all. There. <laughs> Look how big this one is. It's a big mama. So this one is like the, actually this is exactly like the one I showed earlier. It is, but it's like an off-white cream color. But it has the same interior as that one. So it's definitely vintage. Look how far down the pockets are. All the way down there. And then look at how tiny the cell phone pocket is. <laughs> you guys, that's so, it can like fit a lighter, okay? But this is 
pretty nice on the inside. There's a couple stains like right there. It is ginormous. I mean, I can't even show you the whole thing. <laughs> Super big. I think this might put the Louis Vuitton Neverfull to shame. It's just a different shape. So this one we're gonna do 60. It's in pretty good condition for its age. No major damage. Just a little dirty. Zipper works. It is beautiful. It's definitely vintage. Love it. 60 bucks, huge, he huge. Okay, that was everything. I will reuse that and let's get into the next one. <laughs> okay, let's switch you over to here. So this one is from Mechanicsburg, Pennsylvania. And let's see when I got this one. This one, blah, 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 blah. April 6th. So March 31st and April 6th, so that's a week. I usually have good luck catching this box and the shoe. And that's really it. <laughs> okay, let's see what we got. Love these. Ooh, these all look like little bags. This will be fun, okay. This is Fossil, eh. I like Fossil, but if I'm paying these all equal $20 a handbag in here, would I pay $20 for this at the thrift store? No, but it is still cute. It's got the little turn lock. It's just dirty. This, this stain, that might stay there, but that I think I can get off. And then the back is just a little worn from being like on someone's side. Um, this, the strap is good. So let's do 20 on this one. Cute little crossbody. All right, so we have Tory Burch wallet, wristlet. This part looks okay. I do see a stain up here. I will try to get that out. It's like a gray color. There is some wear around the edging of the Tory Burch. You can see that. The inside looks good. So yeah, we have a lot of different compartments. Everything works, zippers work. Yep. Okay, so let's do 25 on it. Another fossil? I, I may not make, I'm, I may just be making my money back on this box. Okay, so this fossil, it's very cute, but it has some stains here I will try to get out. But there's a pocket here and a zipper pocket in the back and the strap looks okay. Oh, there's missing, we're missing a little edge coat right there. That's That looks like it. The inside's a little dirty, a little bit. I might have to soak this one for a couple minutes and see if I can get it cleaner. But we'll do 20 on this one too. Here's your typical Michael Kors again. This one's cute though. This one's gray. This one is gray, pebbled leather. Super buttery. It's a little bent up. It comes with the long handle. I have all these fuzzes going up my nose. The handle, it has a little bit of wear to the edge coat, but not, it's not coming off. If you can see that. Bottom is a little dirty. 
I mean, overall condition, it's good. The edge coat, I mean, I guess it's coming off a little bit. I can't really tell. And then the inside, oh, the inside's nice. Okay. So the inside's nice, clean. Just the outside took a beating. I guess they didn't really take care of it. They must have kept it on the floor, you know, tossed it around, whatever. But it is overall good condition. A little bit of wear, very minor wear all over. Um, we can do 25 on that. All right, last purse. Let's see what it is. Okay. I've never got Cole Haan in one of these bags. So, uh, boxes. So this is Cole Haan. This is very nice. Black pebble leather. Long strap. There is a little bit of edge coat doo-doo right there, but the rest of it looks fine. Bottom. Ooh, the inside is really pretty. Look at that blue. Oh my God, I love that. So there's the um, Cole Haan. Look at the contrast with my nails. How cool is that? Um, and then the other side you have the uh, slip pockets. Really pretty inside. I, I actually really like this one. And I don't like floppy purses like this. And then you can push the, um, well, you get the point. You can make it more like a bucket bag or keep it like this. And that says Cole Haan as well. So let's do 50 on this one. Really nice, really, really, really nice. All right, they made up for it. All right, so that's everything. Oh, you guys, thank you so much for sticking with me this long. That was a lot of purses. This was a lot of work for me. I had to, you know, get them all ready, condition them. I had to write them all down. I had to find prices for them, look them up. So just remember what goes into all these YouTube creators' videos. Um, what you don't see is a lot of work, but I enjoy it. I do it for you guys. I love to bring you guys quality items, unique items when I can, um, and just to have fun. So I hope you did. And thank you all for watching. I really appreciate all of your support and we'll see you in the next one.